It is the Swahili culture from delicacies to antics that welcomes you at the first celebration of World Swahili Day that was marked on Thursday. Pomp and flair also filled the air from Mombasa to Mongoma counties as locals appreciated a local language that has gained recognition in the world. Mwaka wa kwanza kabisa wa kuadhimisha siku ya Kiswahili duniani. Na nimefurahi kuwa hapa na nyinyi ili tu tusherekee pamoja, tuadhimishe kwa mfano, ha? kwa sababu tumeambiwa na profesa kwamba Gracing similar celebration at the Kenya National Museum in Nairobi was Sports CS Amina Mohammed and her tourism counterpart Najib Balala who had a message for the youth. Kiswahili kilizali wapi? Hapa hapa kwetu Kenya. Kwa hivyo lazima sisi tusherekee kuliko wale wengine wote wale wako Paris na wale wako New York na wale wako nchi zingine zote za Afrika. Lugha hii tumike kwenye mambo ya mambo ya vio vya ufundi vya chini ambao ni Tibet pia itumike. Lugha hii itumiwe kwenye shule ya matibabu ambao ni medical school. Swahili enthusiasts including journalists, poets, artists among others who attended the event say Kenya needs to operationalize the National Kiswahili Council. Tuna jukumu kubwa sana wenzangu. Kama wapenda lugha, wataalamu, wa lugha, waandishi, wa lugha ya Kiswahili, tuna jukumu kubwa la kuishauri serikali yetu ya Kenya kuhakikisha kwamba wanakipigia debe Kiswahili kwenye nakala zao zote mabuku yao yote kanuni zao zote sera zao zote ili lugha hii siku moja hata kama sisi hatutakuwa duniani watoto wetu wajivunie kusema kwamba walimu wetu baba zetu wa Kenya waliotangulia wamekipigia debe Kiswahili mpaka sasa hivi ukiingia kwenye wizara yoyote unamsikia mtu akizungumza lugha ya Kiswahili This step will empower them to elevate the Swahili language from a cultural treasure to an academic and commercial level Credits for the day would go to the United Nations of Education, Science and Culture UNESCO who set every 7th of July to be World Swahili Day as a way of making the language popular around the world. Mariam Jahid K24